girlfriends and welcome back to my youtube channel today i will be partnering up with to all my black girls to show you all how to grow your hair overnight this is my hair before i will be using their natural kinky curly clip ends they are 100 percent human hair very manageable and easy to deal with you can style them as if they are your own hair they are very soft very defined and you can use just about any product with them you can color them you can cut them you can do just about anything with them, but as you can see, they also blend very, very well. If you all want to see how to get this really cute hairstyle, then you need to stay tuned so you can fool everybody into thinking it's your real hair. Haha. <laughs> Before I get into the style, I want to start out by saying the clippings I will be using are 16 inch and 18 inches. I will be putting the 16 inch in the back because you do not want to do a really dramatic long length in the back so that it blends more with your hair. So I'll be putting shorter in the back and then blending the longer on top of my crown and in the front of my hair. So to open these clip ends, you kind of just pop them apart as I'm doing in this video and it opens up the sections on them and then you can start to apply them into your hair. I will be doing one with three clip ends on it for the back of my head. It just fit very well. So to do this, you just stick it right into your hair, make sure it's in there really tight. And then once you get it in there really tight, you just wanna clip them all in. Some people might clip them as you go. I did that once I got towards the end, or you can clip them once you got all the clippings stuck into your hair. But you wanna make sure it's in there very well, very tight, and it feels really snug. So as you can see, this is looking bomb, but I'm not done yet. I am going to do a wash and go basically with these clippings so that I make my hair blend very well with the clippings themselves. So I'm gonna be getting my hair wet. And then I will be applying one of my favorite gels, as you all know, my Eco Styler. This is just to define my curl pattern and the hair, blending it more together. And it just works a lot better when you do it this way. So now I'm gonna do that to the other side and to the rest of my hair. Just personally like the method that I am choosing to go by. Some people just put the clip-ins in dry and use their natural curl pattern as dry. I just feel it's a lot easier to blend if you get them wet together and style them together. So how you know what size to use with your clip ends, I basically just stick it around my head, measure it, make sure it's going to fit, and then I clip them all in. So now I'm towards the middle and I'm using the 18 inches. I will be applying the 18 inch because I use 16 inch in the back like I said before. But once you get toward the middle of your head, it make the longer pieces will blend easier with the 16 inch because it's further up on your head, making them almost the same length, just a tiny bit longer. So like I said before, I am just using my gel, blending it in really well. And as you all can see, my curl pattern is blending in so well with these clip-ins and getting them wet and the gel, it just works perfectly. So for the front, I am taking one with two prongs and I am using the 18 inch in the front on these side pieces and then I will be using the 16 inch over that. And then I took some pieces of my natural hair and you wanna make sure your natural hair is blending very well with the top pieces. You wanna make sure no clip-ins are showing, period. So I blended that very well so that it's not noticeable. And I'm just gonna continue this process. Once I get to the front of my head and all my clip-ins are in, I'm just giving myself a cute part. Wherever you like is up to you. I like mine a little to the side, but not too, too much. So then for the front, I want a really defined curl, so I'm going to be finger curling the front pieces of my hair as I blend them in with the top clip-ins. And as you can see, it's blending in very well. And then I'm gonna do the same to the other side. Now I have all my clip ends in and everything is blended very well. As you can see, it mixes in with my natural curl pattern. It looks very good. So now you're wondering, am I gonna diffuse or air dry? So I air dried for about 30 minutes and then I took my diffuser on cool low and I dried the rest of my hair. It didn't take too long to dry. For some reason it dried very quickly, honestly. I guess because I had the natural clip ends in, but it dried really quickly and I'm just loving this. So here are my results like I showed you all before. 
I think it blended really well, but I also have some blending to do. So I'm gonna take my wide tooth comb and I'm gonna blend out the ends, giving them a little more poof that they stick out as much as my natural hair does because I get a lot of volume with my hair. So I'm just giving my clip ends some volume towards the end and I'm gonna be doing this to both sides. And I am officially done and I am loving my hair. I wanna know what you all think about this. Do you all love them? Because I absolutely love them. It's a quick and easy way to grow your hair and it also blends so well. So if you just have a day where you want your hair to be longer, you can put these in and they're very easy to take out. You just unpop them and remove them. So I'm gonna be showing you all two cute styles that I did using this hair. I just took my front curls and left them out and I did this really cute half up, half down. And doing the half up, half down, you just wanna make sure that your extension hair is on the top and the back because your hair will cover up the rest of it. And it just looks a lot better, it blends better, and it's so cute. So I will be showing you all one more style. Let me know what you think of this style. You can do this on your natural curly hair, you can do this with your clip-ins, but I thought it was super, super cute. So for my next style, I'm just gonna do two twists in the front and I'm gonna clip it in the back. It's kind of a half up, half down as well. Just wanted to show you all how easy this hair is to work with and how you can style it and you don't just have to wear it down. You can do whatever you feel free to do with it, whatever you like more. As you all can see, this hairstyle is really cute. You can try this out on your natural curly hair. You can try it with these clip ends. So I just wanna know what you all are thinking of my clip ends. I'm loving them, I'm getting this length that I want. I honestly cannot wait till my hair gets this long for real. But for now, I will be using my clip ends and fooling the whole world. But I just really love them, they blend so well, very soft. Like I said before, 100% human hair. If you all like this style, let me know down below. I will leave the link to the company below and thank you all for watching.